today we're going to decorate Easter cookies. So to begin, we have to make cookies. I use the simple sugar cookie, but you can use your favorite cookie cutter recipe. One of my favorites is Grandma's shortbread cookie, found on the back of the Canada Cornstarch box. If you'd like to see me make these cookies, leave a comment below and I'll post another video making these cookies. Next, we're going to make our icing. I used one cup of icing sugar and two tablespoons of milk, slowly incorporating the milk one tablespoon at a time. Please keep in mind that this icing is great for flooding or filling in a cookie and adding some large details. But for finer details, I use Cake Made Scribblers. If you don't wish to use any scribblers and would like to extra fine detail, I would suggest using a royal icing that involves meringue powder or egg whites. Here, we're continuing to stir the mixture until we develop a nice, thick, even consistency. Once we have our consistency, we're going to add a few drops of yellow food coloring. I added seven drops. Mix thoroughly. Now we spoon it into a piping bag or container and get ready for some piping fun. I had a variety of shapes that I could decorate, but the first one I'll start with is the chick. I start by outlining the shape of the chick with the yellow icing. Then I use the remaining icing to fill in the shape of the chick. And then any areas which aren't covered, I use a toothpick to cover all areas to, smooth a, and to ensure a smooth, consistent layer. See, there's a chick. I'll show you again. Here's the chick. Here's the outline. Here's the filling, and now here's the toothpick to get the fine details. See, a smooth, consistent layer. The same can be applied to an egg. Outline, fill. Now the toothpick. Here we go, a nice egg. Next, we can do a tulip. For this, we're going to outline the shape of some petals. And this can be filled with a yellow or a pink icing. If you fill it with a pink icing, it'll outline the yellow detail. Here, I filled it with a yellow icing. See? Smooth layer. In addition, we can add a lot more decorations if we use more colors. I made a white icing and a pink icing. For the pink icing, I add one drop of red food color. And this is how I decorate the bunnies. I used the white food coloring as a base, and then I would use the pink to pipe in the ears and the nose and the tail. And now we use Cake Made Scribblers to add some fine details, such as the eyes. Well, there you have it, folks. I hope all of you had fun decorating and eating your cookies. I've just shown you some simple designs, but the possibilities are endless. Have fun and be creative. Thanks for watching. I hope all of you enjoyed this video. Please click that subscribe button to be notified of new uploads.